Okay, so first off, we have iFlash. It's an application where you can make flashcards out of it. So this would be really essential for those of you who are learning new terms, you know, like advanced literary terms. If you're studying something very defined, as in like an autobiography of someone, you know, this would be really good if you want to know more about them. All right, so you can buy this application for $14.99 in the App Store. So you can go right ahead and search iFlash on the App Store and you can, you know, view all of its information here. All right, so you can set this on your iPhone or iPod Touch and obviously on the iOS. Let's go inside and check out iFlash's interface. So here we have a bunch of options here so let's just make our own new deck okay so like I said if you guys want to learn something about Shakespeare you can test yourself like when was this person born on this day and you can say Shakespeare or etc so I'm gonna put my own terms All right, so you decide how you want to make your flashcards. So you can write the definition on the front side or on the back side. It's your choice. It's your application, you do anything to it. Okay, so once you have like a load of terms, you can go ahead and click on study. This application does keep track of your memorization progress. So click on study. And there's options here, so use all cards. For this, if you have like like a billion words, you can use the left hand arrow keys. Uh, so if you want to go uh, right, it will let you see the next cards. Um, if you want to see the answer, you can go ahead and click on the up key or vice versa. So if I don't know the definition of this, of the word definition, I can go ahead and click the up arrow key and it would show me the definition or you can obviously use it with your mouse but like I said if you have like a thousand words you would get really tired using your mouse so go ahead and use the arrow keys and also the great advantage of this application is your time writing the definitions and the terms on a piece of paper when you can have this application here which is simpler but yeah guys this is iFlash tell me what you guys think would you buy it would you not